We understand the basic physics of how molecules and surfaces interact with radiation, and we do that through very careful measurements in the laboratory. And the models have to actually do a good job of simulating those measurements. But we, we're not just simulating something that we saw in a particular circumstance. We're simulating the physics that produced that interaction. And this physics, we think, is universal. So whether I'm studying greenhouse effects on Earth or trying to understand the surface pressure on Mars, uh, I use the same technique and the same models. The keys of the Virtual Planetary Laboratory are a very sophisticated radiative transfer model, a climate model, a chemistry model, and a cloud model. With those components, we can build planets that are very realistic. This is what we're trying to do in, in the Virtual Planetary Laboratory. That's the idea. It's, you can build your own planet and determine what its most likely environment is by running these tools.